Well, hello there. Welcome back. Uh, still in Roulette Rivals 5, we are uh, preparing for the upcoming match between Damchico and Fenium. And uh, yeah, spin's arriving in like seven seconds. All right, so we have the target with a silenced assault rifle, one disguised as a security guard. This should be uh, an interesting spin. Girl, I can do your sneaking in. So what the fuck is this? Right, Damn Chico uh, loading in. Fenium already at it. Both starting as the security guard disguise. Um... This map does have a blue objective that they will also have to take care of. That was terrible for you. Thank you. That's the first backup data disk secured. Two more to locate. That was terrible for you. Both guys have the same plan, taking out the evidence with the EMP. Which is a really good idea. It's, uh, it's oh, fast. but oh. Fania misses throw. Yeah. No, that's Dam Chiku. Sorry. That Fania did place it, so his. Oh one right, was yes, hit. yeah. And then. So I was looking. That's at a the restart one from Dam Chiku. Right back into it, though. Yeah, Fenium's made his way to the Athena's office. Wow. Yeah, Chico gets the EMP toss this time. Ah, uh, Fenium getting spotted doing that knockout. It's gonna have to be a restart there. Right, Dom Chico's actually come out to the other side so he can get uh, Fabian's data disc. Well played shot. Is that second data disc? Oh, a little bit. Oh. Oh, oh! I have to be assistant. careful here. Secretary. Wow. Okay, that was very, very close. It's got the uh, attack four SA single shot assault rifle. It'd be really nice to not cause a little panic. Yeah, perfect for distraction shots. Gets two of them off. Fanium's also back in the uh, Athena's office again. Does he have the oh. two data discs, or does he just have the one right now? Damchiku has two, but Fanium only has one. Only has the one. Didn't go for Fabian. This is interesting, you see... Oh, looks like he's going to, uh, he's going for the knockout on the various guards. And Chuku, uh, also going for knockout chain. Stadium got the kill. Swaps out to the disguise. Now he has to go get, uh... 
Oh, that's a body found on Jamchiku's side. I don't think he, he knocked out the two guards that were in the office quick enough, and so he had to, uh, when he when he went to do the isolation on Athena, uh, they were already on the move. Vanium in a favorable position uh, currently. Still has to take out, uh, he still has to get the third uh, data disc. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. I don't think he has any tranks left over, so he has so. to. He's got to isolate. That's... This is going to be risky. Yeah, especially because uh, Perez actually walks up these stairs. It's part of his cycle. There's a knockout. This is the briefcase. Yeah, uh, I'm guessing he's just banking on getting out of here before Perez makes his way up the stairs. Yeah, he should be able to. I mean, Perez uh, should be looking for his disguise first. Yeah. Oh wait, and no, never mind. He's, he's he had the doesn't have a disguise. He had the CEO. But uh, yeah, I mean, he was knocked out, so it and will take CEO some time for him to get here. Yeah. But Fanium gets the, to the exit. He gets the win. Yeah, that's five stars of Silent Assassin. That was. Very, very quick, especially coming off of, of a Paris that ended in a draw. Um, and Chiku just got spotted trespassing. So, yeah, sometimes that's just the way that it goes. We got Mendoza coming up. I'll actually do a prediction this time. I believe this is Fanium's pick. Yes, this is All right, prediction is live in the chat. In the meanwhile, uh, what do you guys, what do you guys want to see on this spin? What do you guys want to, what do you guys think is going to happen? Who's going to take this all? Any particular disguises or kill methods anybody would like to see? Uh, Papa Levi is asking, how is the Fanium versus Ducker track record? I don't know. I think... I think uh, they faced in the finals of Roulette Rivals 4. Ducker won that. That's, uh, that's what I remember. I'm not sure if they... They might have played again in the same tournament before, but... I do remember the finals was uh, Fanium. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, apologies for a little... Uh, <laughs> I'm tired. <laughs> no, it's, it's been a long day for Punky. And we got a we got heavy heavy votes uh, on the Fanium side. Oh, I see. Yeah. So I, I pulled up the uh, old Roulette Rivals four bracket, and it looks like in the semifinals, Ducker beat Fanium, but then Fanium won his way back. Uh, 
in the lower bracket, and they faced off in the finals, and then Ducker beat Fanium again. All right, so what we have? Um, tomorrow, Loud Pistol uh, with Lawyer Don with Fire Axe as Tango Musician. That's an interesting one. Uh, Providence Herald and Tango Musician. Machete Gaucho, Yates. Uh, tomorrow, Fiber Wire, Tango Musician. Okay. That'd be an interesting one as well. I don't even know where to get falling objects for tomorrow. You are, I'm in the same boat. I don't know. Falling object for tomorrow is not allowed. It is a banned one? Okay. Yeah. But we definitely won't get that one. And drag her body all the way to the top uh, floor in the villa, obviously. Yeah, that's true. Alright, we got the spin arriving in 33 seconds, so... Ugh, get your predictions in if you're gonna. Uh, vote with those channel points if you wanna. And uh, yeah, let's get ready for, for another round of Roulette Rivals. This is our last match for a while. I don't think that there's another match for a few yeah, hours. 12 hours. Yeah, 12 hours. So. so this is where you guys are gonna get your Roulette Rivals fix. And then you guys are gonna have to wait. Oh, I definitely have mine today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so how yeah have you been oh we got the spin uh all right so it's yates with a kitchen knife while disguised as head of security and vidal with a neck snap while disguised as mercenary so really all 47 has to do is take off his his sunglasses and he'll be the mercenary uh -huh. uh, so long as and he gets take out the tie sword. yeah and ta yeah and take out the tie. maybe remove the stripes but very similar there It should be quick. Uh, I'm guessing that both of these players have a plan. Yeah, it should be. It's a relatively simple spin. Um... Nigga says there's only one kitchen knife on this map, really. Oh, man. <laughs> man. It's, uh, it's because it's the end of the day. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, it would have been loud shotgun and uh, fiber wire. <laughs> Jesus By golly, there is only one kitchen knife on this whole map. Wow. Papa Levi is uh, requesting your services as an admin for his next match. The standard Tamara lure here on the these bushes here. Yeah, I think uh, I think Sam Chiki just did the same thing. There's the uh, Frisk Bypass uh, by Sam Chiku. Yeah, he's slightly ahead here because he's the phone's audio distraction, but Fanium's catching up quick. Got tomorrow. They do have to put in a little bit of work to get uh, Cortazar's disguise. Both players using but mercenaries are everywhere. Yeah. Right, there's Don Yates isolated as well. Replant from, oh, from Damchiku. Damchiku. 
Well, lead goes to Fanium firmly. I have to imagine we're going to see very similar setup again. By damn Chiku when he when he comes back in. Fanium should have the uh, the mercenary disguise here. All right, Dem Chiku going for the same uh, Vidal lore. Works like a charm. Yeah, if it's not a suit or a life, this is the go to. Fanium got the kill on Tamara. It's gonna emetic poisoned Cortazar here. At least that's what it looked like. Now Chica's heading back to isolate to prepare Don Yates. Yeah. Nice punch. That was it, yeah. So, the unconscious witness is uh, Yates, so he should be fine here. Good isolation. Looks like he's going to. Do the same thing to get the mercenary disguise as Fenium did. Fenium, uh, while waiting on Cortazar to go get. Uh, sick somewhere, he's run down to grab the kitchen knife, so good use of time. Uh, damn, Chiku is looking for a kitchen knife here in the kitchen of the villa. Yeah, he's has, he has to turn to a hit maps. Dang. Oh, there's a Cortazar disguise uh, for Fanium, and now he just has to get back up to Yates. Nice distraction to get past the enforcer there. Mm -hmm. That guy's an enforcer. I don't think there's enforcers on this side, though. If there is, I think it's just a second one. That guy's always an enforcer. Yeah, there we go. Tam Chiku also has tomorrow. But he does have to uh, get the kitchen knife, as you mentioned. Yeah. And he's still got to get Cortazar. Fenium should have a clear path to go take care of Yates. Taking his time there, making sure that his uh, his lock on is good. Uh, opting not to grab the car keys. Yeah, interesting. Yeah. Oh, I guess he did earlier. I just I didn't why see was it. the lock still there? I don't good. know. Yeah. It should have just been gray, but anyways, I'm not going to question yeah. Hitman at this point. Don't have to. <laughs> we don't have the time. Yeah. But looks like it's game for Fanium, 555. Yeah. Yeah, the replan on Dan Chiku's part really, really set him behind there. But 
I mean, great runs from both players. Like, they both obviously had a plan. Um, and their plans were fairly similar. <laughs> they, it looked like it was almost identical on, on either side for the first bit. Uh, but then Damn Chiku had to do that restart, and Fanium didn't. And sometimes it's just the way that it goes. I hope I need somebody to refresh the two seconds. All right, so the match goes to Fanium. Uh, clean sweep, 4-0. What the fuck? What are they even talking about? <laughs> you gotta pull. What is going on? What the fuck? Okay, so uh, let's, uh, we'll hop over to see upcoming matches real quick. Congrats to both players again uh, on that. Very exciting. Um, so, coming up in, I think Punky said like 12 hours, we have uh, Purple Key versus Curry Maker. Uh, and that'll be on Meme Junkie's channel. So, do go check that out. Um, if you'd like to see uh, these upcoming matches for yourself, you can uh, go to the link that just got posted in chat or go to hitmaps.com, scroll down to the upcoming matches, matches section, and you'll see them listed in your time zone, uh, which is. What I do, because that's a heck of a lot easier than converting time zones. Um, but yeah, so we got lots and lots more Hitman Rivals, Roulette Rivals matches coming up. Um, this was a console one, so we're going to take a look at the console bracket real quick. As I go to interact with the console bracket. Um, this was an upper bracket match. Uh, yes, at the top here. So, Fanny moves on. He's going to play I Like Hitman in round three. Uh, meanwhile, uh, Damchiku has been relegated to the lower bracket in round one uh, against Bait Pricks. So, yeah. So, do go check out the brackets as well for yourself. Uh, you can get there by going to this link that's in the chat right now uh, for the PC and the console uh, brackets, respectively. Uh, but that's going to do it for us for today. Thanks, everybody, so much for coming out and hanging out and stuff. Uh, Punky, do you have anything else that you want to say? Uh, no, thanks for uh, all the delays and waiting on all the delays Yeah, we appreciate stuff. everybody's patience, very much so. Uh, all right, let's see who is live, see who we can give a raid to. Um, we have Script Desk is live. He's playing Hitman 3 right now. Uh, shall we give Script Desk a little raid? All right. Cool. Well, thanks again, everybody, for coming out. This was a lot of fun. Punky, thank you so much for joining me. Yeah, thank you for having me. And that's going to do it. So we'll see you guys over in Script Desk channel. And, uh, yeah, stay safe out there. See you. See you.